CompTIA A Plus Core 2, 220-1102, Practice Exam. Questions 136 through 140. This video is part of our practice exam video series and is filled with questions that closely resemble the real exam. So are you prepared to test your knowledge? Great, let's begin. Question 136. A company's IT manager is developing guidelines to regulate which websites employees can visit during work hours. What type of document is the manager most likely preparing? The answer is B. AUP. An acceptable use policy, or AUP, is a set of rules that governs the ways in which a system may be used. It specifies what users are allowed and not allowed to do when using company resources such as computers, networks, and internet access. The document the IT manager is creating outlines permitted online activities for employees, defining acceptable behavior and usage of company resources. This ensures compliance with organizational policies and helps maintain a secure and efficient work environment. Question 137. A company needs to ensure that a specific task runs automatically every time a user logs into their Windows workstation. This task involves copying a large file from the local machine to a designated folder on a network drive using a script. Which of the following file types would most likely be used for this type of script? The answer is A. .bat. A .bat file or batch file is a special type of text file containing a series of commands that are executed by the Windows command line interpreter. These commands are executed in sequence, allowing for automation of tasks such as file management, program execution, and system configuration. Batch files are useful for scripting repetitive tasks, making them ideal for scenarios where automation is needed. Question 138. A user is working on their Mac OS computer when an application suddenly stops responding. They need to close this unresponsive application. Which of the following Mac OS features can help the user close the unresponsive application? The answer is D. Force quit. Force quit is a feature in macOS designed to allow users to close applications that have stopped responding. Users can access it through the Apple menu by selecting Force Quit, or they can use the keyboard shortcut, Command Option Escape, to bring up the Force Quit applications window. This feature is crucial for maintaining system stability and preventing further issues when an application fails to close normally. Question 139. Which of the following file system types is natively used by a macOS device? The answer is C. APFS. The Apple File System, or APFS for short, is designed specifically for macOS to optimize performance and efficiency. It offers features like strong encryption, space sharing, and improved file system management. APFS has been the default file system for macOS devices since the release of macOS High Sierra in 2017. Question 140. A company has recently hired a contractor that will be performing nighttime building maintenance. As such, the IT manager is worried about the security risks associated with unsupervised contractors having access to the office. Which of the following security measures can help prevent unauthorized access to the computers? The answer is A. Enable screen locks. Enabling screen locks ensures that computers automatically lock after a period of inactivity, preventing unauthorized individuals from accessing the system. This is particularly important when computers are left unattended such as during night shifts when cleaning staff or other unsupervised personnel are present. By requiring a password or other authentication method to unlock the screen, this measure helps secure sensitive information. Also, while not presented as an answer option, restricting login times could be another viable solution in this scenario. So, did any of these questions give you a tough time? Don't worry if they did, it's all part of the learning process. 
Luckily, Certification Synergy has a wealth of free video content at your disposal. To stay connected with our latest IT learning resources, just give a quick click on the subscribe button. This simple action ensures you're always updated about our newest video releases. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more great content.